Time to get up. Time to make it happen. <sighs> Morning, Mel. Morning, Mel. Morning, kitty. Morning, kitty. Good morning. It's Jeremy Callahan, the app man. A day in the life of an app developer. I'm heading out to the client site, which is in Pleasanton, California. I'm currently in San Francisco, California, in Fort Mason Park. Check, check, check. Out the ride. That's it, the app man. Here we go. Day in the life. Okay, made it to the client site and for those of you who don't know, I have three things going right now. One, I'm at the client site where I manage a team of eight developers. They're offshore in India. And then I work with the team here during hours in California to make sure everything's running smoothly. So I'll be in meetings all day, as well as meeting with the offshore team and demoing some stuff. In addition to that, I'm working on a project called Golf BPM, which is a mobile app. So once finished here, and kind of everybody goes home. I stay later, and that's when I actually start coding. So for that, I've got to create a table. I'm going to connect to a database. I'm going to write a web service in PHP. I'm going to write some JavaScript. And then I'm going to store it as local storage. So I'll let you know how that coding turns out, because that's going to take a while. It could be challenging. Our third project is called Property Manager Pro. There are some bugs that the client found, so I'm going to work those out and send her a new build. OK, so that's what I'm going to do today. I'll report back later and see how we do. Bye. So I started having a um, full-blown panic attack. So for me, when I have a panic attack, it basically, my heart starts beating a little fast or like something like that, or I get a tightness in my chest. And I basically think that I'm going to have a heart attack and die, <laughs> right? Like I'm just gonna fall on the ground and die or something or whatever. And so, that's what a panic attack is for me. I'm feeling a lot better now, but I was not feeling good for a while there. All right, it's uh, six o'clock. The day coders are gone. This place is like a ghost town at probably like 5.30. So now we can get some coding done. Yeah. Okay, so I altered the plan a little bit, but I'm the boss, I get to do that on this project. So I'm working on this music player right now. And there's two tracks that play at the same time. One is the music and one's the voiceover. And so ideally I want this to happen when I hit the play button, but I can't figure out how to do that yet because I have to load two songs at the same time and then have a play function. But I can run it from here so you'll hear it now. Ready. Hear the set. voice? Here we go. So I want to be able to mute one, that voice out. Two, three. And I can do it from here. One. Two, three. So I'll mute it on this one. One. See how I muted the voice out? Now, the only problem is, is I gotta be able to get that to happen when the user clicks the play button. I'm doing it from over here. So that's what I'm working on right now. Okay, so this is typical app development 101. I, uh, I fixed one thing. So I can click this button now. All good. Problem is, this little thing's not moving across the screen like it should be. And that, my friends, is app development. You fix one thing and it always breaks something else. So now I gotta fix that. Okay, so I'm leaving the office now, about 12 hours into my day. Had a great day. Got um, Property Manager Pro, we got that out. So the client can look at that and test that out. And then I altered the plan on the Golf BPM and I decided to go after the audio because I talked to our musician today and he wanted me to make sure that we could test two audio tracks the, the same way, the way, we, the way he had sent them. So I did that uh, successfully. So now he can continue on with the music so it won't hold him up. And all the client meetings, everything went well. 
The offshore team's doing good, handed a bunch of stuff off to them just now as well so that they can code overnight. And I'm gonna drive home, it's gonna take about 45 minutes. And of course, I parked all the way in the back of the lot. There's the app man's vehicle right there. So I can get a nice walk in. I want to wrap up today. Thanks for traveling along with me and seeing what I do on a regular day when I go to work. That's the app dev life. I know I post a lot of cool things on the internet about all the cool places I'm at and the cool things I'm doing. But what it really comes down to is that working really hard, having a good time, enjoying what I do. And I'm glad you tagged along today. Hope you enjoyed it. Bye.